your last day to catch the outdoor downtown Appleton Farmers Market before it moves indoors. And you couldn't ask for a better day to be outside. Pauline Lee is with us this morning. Hi, Pauline. That is definitely true. I like the weather. It's starting to warm up here and the sun's really starting to come up. Lots of things going on here. You have kind of like your traditional harvest, kind of like the squash, the gourds, the potatoes and the corn. And then you also have the fall crop, but the season you have apples. So we have, we're checking out Thurn's apples. We, can, we have Lori here this morning. I'm going to stop her for a bit. Good morning, Lori. Good morning. Let's just talk about your apple crop. Now, which one of these, your best seller is actually over here, kind of hidden in the corner. Yep, the honey crisp. That's a big seller. Everybody likes that. They come here just for that. Mm -hmm. yeah. How was the how was the crop this year? Real good, real mm -hmm. good. We've got uh, a lot more than I think. My uncle is the the owner of Thurn's Apples, and I think the crop is better than he thought they were going to be. Oh. You also have pears here. I see. What kind of pears do you have? Uh, Flemish beauties. We have. We have a Bosque pear, which is a little bit firmer pear. We have a Wisconsin pear, real sweet and juicy. Mm -hmm. And something new. I I haven't seen these before. They're called Moon Glow pears. Oh. Um, and I have to tell you, I haven't tasted one yet, so I can't tell you what those taste like. Oh, but boy. people come here again just for the pears too. Yeah, most definitely. We got to move down the table here. We have another thern down here. There's tons to choose from, and there's a little kind of like a cheat sheet about what each one tastes like. We have Isaiah over here. Good morning, Isaiah. Good morning. So let's face here. We'll go this way. So walk us through what what kind of apples do we have on this side of the table? So we have all kinds of apples, and what we usually do is we have more eating apples down here and baking apples towards that way. Okay. Now I asked you earlier, what's your favorite apple? And you said it depends on three factors. What are they? Um, the three factors would be, I guess, skin taste, uh, are they juicy or dry, and then um, just the taste in general. Are they sweet or tart? I did not realize this. all this went into apples. Okay, so again, which one is your favorite apple? I would have to say Thurn's apples because they're nice, fresh, and crunchy. Oh, wait. Thurn's apples? Well, which one of the Thurn's apples do you like? All these apples. Oh, good answer. Look at that. Now, you told me earlier there was one new crop this year. Was it the snow sweet? Yes. So what does that one taste like? Um, It's like the snow. They're a little bit firmer, though, mm -hmm. and they're called snow sweet is because they're white inside. Okay. Okay. So now are you guys going to be a part of the indoor market, too? Yes, yeah, it will perfect. be. So if you can't make it out today to grab these apples, come next week when the market moves indoors. So just head to our website, fox11online.com, for all the information. He's a natural salesman. <laughs>